female um, levels of adultery are the same as men now. Mm. Um, since the 1920s, uh, the data has been that uh, men have been, are more adulterous, that they've had more partners with more action per partner. And, and now, uh, among people under the age of 40, women are just as... Um, uh, uh, as adulterous as men. And what, is, and what does that break down to? Sort of like, uh, what, what, are, what kinds of numbers do we have that give us some sense in the general population? Of it's very difficult to know. I've studied yeah, this for yeah, 40 yeah. years. Yeah, that's right. And, uh, you know, it's very interesting. For example, um, they, there was a recent study in which they asked men and women how many sex partners you've had in the last year. And men said a whole lot more than women did. Well, I don't believe either of them, but nevertheless, uh -huh. men, men said a whole lot more than women did. Then they hooked them up to a, um, a lie detector, and uh -huh. women had actually had more partners than men had. Okay. <laughs> the numbers range from the Kinsey reports in the, in, the, in the late 40s and early 50s, when about one-third of men had had, had, been, had had an adulterous affair, and only about 15 to 25 percent of women had. Mm -hmm. and the data goes back to the 1920s. It, it all looks as if men have had more affairs than women have. But in our modern age, as I said, among people uh, uh, under the age of 40, women are doing it. But no, we will never know because it's, some, it's too powerful and people lie. In fact, you know, I've often wondered, you know, if men are having all these adulterous affairs, who are they having them with? Uh -huh. They're not having them with women.